Okay. Uh, and welcome to the last episode of Fantasy Star 4. Hopage had me a little worried for a minute there. <laughs> for a minute there. Do, 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 do. It said capture fail, which it like never has said before. Failure. Woo. Hmm. The ranch owner the ranch owner is and he had such great hopes. Have you examined this is atrocious. They must have been done in by the black energy wave. It's locked. They must have noticed the black wave and quickly closed their doors. But a door like this is completely useless. <laughs> wait, it's no wait, use. Wait, wait a second. It's, uh, it's worse than that. He's dead, Chaz. <laughs> it's worse than that. They're dead, Chaz. Dead, Chaz. Ooh, this is pretty gruesome. <laughs> Look at the old man. <laughs> He fell over in the most <laughs> hilarious way. Yeah, well, the final dungeon is right here. It's a big black hole. All right. Cut okay. It. Cut it. Welcome, my friends, to the oh, edge. my eyes! <laughs> my eyes, my brain! Hi, Junior. <laughs> cat, mm. The cat has entered the room. And the cat loves Mike's coat. It is a nice coat. Yeah, those weird dimensional worm things that were on the that were on the one sides of the sky, they can only be hurt by certain types of spells or light attacks. The encounter rate around here is very high. And the enemies give really good uh, XP. Um, Mark, you should be watching the video. Yeah, I, I'm just doing something real quick. Uh, but yeah, 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 you're right. But I, I am you know, just doing something real quick. So. Where we have to go is up, but uh, I'm going to go down for a bit. I'm going to show off this place in its entire eye bleeding glory. And there's a certain enemy around here that I want to show off. Hmm. Alright. I almost forgot. Everybody's up to level 99. Which is basically overkill for this game. But, uh... It's kind of a fantasy star tradition, so... Seriously? I... My eyes are... Bugging out, man! <laughs> this actually looks like a graphical effect I would expect to see This actually in looks man. like something that's very close to being capable of causing seizures. But, you see the gradients and whatnot? Yeah. It kind of reminds me of Vector Man's graphics. Especially with all the green. Soldier friend! Oh, this is like one of the most painful dungeons I have ever seen to look at. Uh, at least it's not gross. Yeah, but you know what? Plain old bricks are at least easy to look at. This is like, what is going on? We've entered another dimension. A dimension of evil and chaos. And also, the floor is conveniently illuminated to tell us that we're going somewhere. Mmm. Mm. Oatmeal. Mmm. <laughs> Mark's having a late breakfast. Yes. I would have had it ages ago, but I couldn't find anything to eat. It was weird. That reminds me, I'm low on cereal at my house. Hmm. That could be a problem for later. Indeed. Since I'm going over to Mike's house. <laughs> this is a dead end, but I want to show off all the enemies here. Mm. Why are the feeling Jake's, Jacob's going to get here in the middle of this video? <laughs> Probably. With our luck. <laughs> what the luck? Not sure if I've heard anyone ever say that, surprisingly. Hmm. So far, with my luck, I haven't been running into any of the enemies that I want to run into yet. Alright, um... So, we had Hoshpaj mess the crap up 
Almost. And if it does it again, we're in big trouble. Soldier friends. I'm trying to find a very specific enemy. An enemy that I actually found right as the dumb thing stopped working. Well, Dark Riders is not the enemy I'm looking for, but, uh, Mark? Yeah. Welcome to the gym. Welcome the to the edge. gym. At the edge it, of the... At the edge of the universe. <laughs> I can get you started with some otherworldly exercises. Sure to buff your muscles. Uh. Hapash, I want to make something abundantly clear. I, I thought he was actually saying something for a second there. Hapash, I want to make something abundantly clear. I don't trust you at all anymore. Geely Frag. Hey, uh, look, it's a frag fest. I'm not even going to watch that screen. I'm just going to watch this screen. It's like, it's a shame there's a stupid lag, but that's the way it has to be for this video. I can watch both screens at the same time, actually. Well, you're not eating. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. Lollipop. That doesn't count. <laughs> okay. Chaos Bringers! Oh, these guys can drop a defeat axe, which is the strongest weapon for, uh, Breeze. I've already gotten that in off-screen grinding, but, uh, I just wanted to make note of that. Oh, also, those, uh, Dark Riders that we ran into earlier can drop Moon Slashers for Kyra. Oh, dang it! The guts. And, I, I don't know how much... Of this, you got it's not like this is that one end of the area. Hopaj has been messing up with us, or actually, it could very well be my Wii U's HDMI slot. I don't, I yeah. don't know because this didn't happen when we were playing Hyrule Warriors on my Wii U. Mm -mm. We're Smash Brothers on your Wii U. Mm -hmm. Well, I can tell you one thing when we record Monster Hunter with two computers, uh. You're definitely going to be recording with the, uh, old Hopaj model. I, I've had, like, issues, and this happened today, too, when we were trying to switch the cables for the different Hopaj. Well, like, I would go, I try to go back to the Wii menu, and all of a sudden, I just get a blank, the Wii U menu, I mean, from the Wii menu, and I'd get a blank screen for no reason. So... Yeah, and I've had that happen to me on my TV, too. So, I don't know what's up with that. Uh, I'm still looking for that one particular enemy. That enemy that would have been captured once. Ah, uh, you know what? I think this is, like, the last area before the boss, so... It I am just going to say we're going to fast forward slash cut to that enemy. Okay. <laughs> it's going to be funny. Jacob will probably be here once we find the enemy. Okay. We fi finally found this guy. I had a recording of fighting this dude before. Well... No, we didn't have a recording. The recording stopped right before this guy showed up. And it was while I was fighting this dude, which by the way, he's the he's the Dark Force from the first Fantasy Star. While I was in the middle of fighting this guy, Mark was like, uh, Mike, the recording stopped. Uh, he didn't get to use his mouth laser. This guy, that guy gives 13... 1099 experience the most experience out of any uh, any regular enemy in the whole game wow oh okay so this is the final area for... so I could have ran into him here but I didn't want to chance it chance it chance it chance it chance it what is that bless it bless it <laughs> Oh, wait, this is the... Uh, oh, okay. Now this looks like the battle background. See? 
Oh yeah. Mm. Here. Oh my goodness. What is this? We have found the profound darkness. You cannot comprehend the profound darkness. This this is the shape of the the profound darkness is taken. Ah, what's happening? It's an it's an mark. What is that word? It's emanation. It's an emanation of the profound darkness, anger, hatred of all things that live, of all that lives, and a great need to destroy. We've got to defeat this thing. This being must not be allowed to come to Algo. Nothing can be more awesome than me. Yeah. <laughs> the portal is not a, is not completely open yet. We've got to take advantage of this opportunity, Chaz. Right. Let's go, everybody. Roger. Yes. This is it. Now we determine Algo's future. Our future. What does it look like? That's just its first form. Okay, I was gonna say, I'm actually a little disappointed. They're all talking at the same time. It's like, <laughs> Actually, um, okay, yeah, you use Ray Blade. I don't want to fight this thing on stupid mode. I may be extremely overleveled, but uh, I've gotten overly cocky before. <laughs> Remember? Yep. I will put up a barrier. Eat Ray Blade in your face, Blade. Bam. Efess your sins and be cleansed by the Saint Fire. Yay. And. Honk your horns and be honked by the car outside! What? <laughs> like, this thing is an abomination! I think that's the point. <laughs> it's just a big gooey mess with fangs everywhere. Good thing we have Raja. Raja is the only one that can refill characters' TP, and he can also, um, and he can heal everyone, including our android friend, Yay. with his miracle skill. Yay! Boom! Plus, Saint Fire does a pretty decent amount of damage. Oh, it's turning into TV static! Look out! Here is its second form. Ah, looks like Jacob will be joining us for the conclusion of this game. Not boy. Not boy. Double slash. Saint Fire. Posse Bolt. Destruct! It's just easier to put something over the cat bird, to be honest. Alright. Uh, so, now, let's so, see. Tech. Let me see. So with Let Ray me... Blade. Double I don't slash. know why it's taking so long. I'm not using any of the bandwidth right now. Yes. Posi Bolt. Good inbox. And my TP odd. could use. Maybe we can check it with my phone. That's a Rexio. Let's get our TP back. You're right. I totally missed all the yellow printed papers with 30% off on them. Final price twelve dollars. Nice. <laughs> Sweet. Is that a hot dog. Yes. Mmm. Hot dog. This is uh this is the greatest uh, greatest set of guests we've had on the show. We've got uh our friend Jacob over there and Junior. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Junior. <laughs> Ray 
Beyblade. Blade. Let it rip in your face. It's like this thing started as a big fleshy mess with fangs everywhere, but now it's a big fleshy mess with fangs everywhere and whatever those are. It's turning into a palm tree. And now <laughs> it's yeah. time for its final form. It's a chick. Chick. <laughs> Look where Chaz's face is. He's like, "Hello, what do we got down here, then?" <laughs> oh my! <laughs> uh, so the main villain of the entire fantasy star series was a thing that looks like a chick. Exactly. The profound uh, darkness. Uh, if you don't want a cat sniffing your drink there. I, I, I highly doubt he'll find my Coca-Cola that interesting. <laughs> but the investigation... Megid! Let's use Megid on the naked Lady. chick. <laughs> it's, ha it's hair is on fire! Someone put it out! It's Mrs. Flare Hair! Ugh! Uh, oh, make it out, out, make it from the boss hurts. Even though I am, everybody is at maximum level, <laughs> which took him a long time to get to. <laughs> well, I should have been grinding in this dungeon. Eat a laser that can destroy space fortresses. Yeah, that's the that thing is so overpowered, but like, it doesn't really do that much. Fire. It should honestly just kill everything in one go. <laughs> If it could destroy a space station. Yeah. These are like the most powerful characters ever in a Fantasy Star game. I mean, Ren is a highly advanced robot with space, de space fortress destroying weaponry built in. Rika is an improvement on Nays and the, the whole genetically engineered Newman. Rune is the fifth generation Lutz, which is like the most power, the fifth generation of the most powerful wizard to ever be in the Algo Solar System, and he has the memories and experiences of the previous four. Welcome to Assassin's Creed, everybody. <laughs> uh, Junior is up in the back. Junior, Junior, no, no, do not. Even get close to that game system, buddy. <laughs> and Chaz was basically raised and trained by the strongest and most capable one. hunter on all on the planet that he was that he's from. I'm not sure if Junior's capable of turning the system off or kicking. A, well, actually, it wouldn't matter if it kicked, he kicked the disc out. There's no disc for this game. <laughs> um. But I do what want to make, just don't, you know, you can go down, but stay away from the electronics, okay? Our fifth member, Raja, is not a main character. He, at, at the end of the game, at, at the end of the game, you can choose a fifth person to, out of your previous allies to join you. The only system an animal can switch on and off is any, any other major system than that. <laughs> The Xbox is easy. The PS3 is even easier. <laughs> the PS3, you can just step on it. <laughs> Especially if you have his version, which has a touch sense. Oh yeah, yeah. that's right. <laughs> Pop hat. It's off. It doesn't matter how hard you touched it. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, I also don't want him knocking it because he actually he... with the with the PS3 I have, you have to hold your finger on the touch sense for a few seconds. So he actually doesn't just step on. Yeah, he, um, but if he knocked it over, he might mess up the connection, which would be equally bad. Well, at least for the recording. Yeah, for the recording. Oh, reason. I mean, if, you were, if we were just playing the game outright, then... Cancel. Oh, <laughs> whatever. That, the thing the boss just did there gets rid of all my stat buffs that I did at the beginning. Oh, great. So it's haze. Pretty much, but it only uses that when it's, like, really close to death. So, just... Keeps attacking it away about these, I think. <laughs> yeah. So, I had... Oh, yay! <laughs> they really like using the color red for destruction sequences in this game. Especially when you kill Dark Force or any of its uh, incarnations. And... 
Ah, what's going on? Oh, I'm not controlling this text. Oh. The force holding this dimensional hole open. Come on. Is gone. <laughs> what? I sense you a time fit warp. That. <laughs> it's getting bigger. Danger. Danger, Chaz Ashley. <laughs> and your girly sounding last name. <laughs> <laughs> what are we supposed to do? What the? Whoa! It's Guardians of the Galaxy! <laughs> I think his sword just exploded. It's protecting us! It's beautiful. Thank you all. It looks like fireflies. Oh yes, and that sword also houses the memories and experiences of past fantasy star characters. Which was being used by the guy trained personally and raised, basically, by the strongest hunter. It's over, huh, Chaz? Yes, it's over. It's over! We were able to keep all go see. And... The sky's blue. <laughs> Hi, Landale! Departure preparations are complete. And? Well, I guess I'll... I guess we'll head back to Desolus. <laughs> we... Well, we'll get a ride with Ren. It was quite a fun journey, Chaz, the likes of which I... <laughs> Give me a minute. <laughs> Wait for... I haven't had in a long time. <laughs> I've been waiting for that text for a long time. Wait, you've done something like this before? <laughs> you should come visit Desolus once in a while. Yes? That's not possible! They don't have a spaceship! And? G go on. <laughs> and flapping their arms won't get them too far! Ha <laughs> ha! Get... Well, yeah, if you space travel with your arms flapping. <laughs> yeah. So... I guess it's really goodbye, Chaz. Yes. What a pity! You won't be in you won't be able to enjoy my wit anymore. Waiting. <laughs> uh, I will go to the land to assist my master, Juan Ren. Uh, goodbye, Chaz. I feel like sometimes the text moves faster. Eventually, the time will come when both my master and I will. What? You'll do what? What are you, what are you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Become unnecessary to all go. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's better than blowing up. But until that time, I will work to complete my duties. Oh, good, good thing that's not the system you're using. <laughs> oh, after I take everybody to Desolus, I will return to Zalan. And... And then... And then... I guess you will need the support of the system a little and while then. longer. <laughs> oh, good grief. He says while long. I remember that. Okay. <laughs> there, while there long. it is. We waited a while longer for that. Ren, where's Rika? She has already gone to the Landale. Why does she have the creepy, shadowy face? Parting must be difficult for her. I see. Well, at least that moved fast. Goodbye, Chaz. Stay well. I believe we will meet again. Uh huh. You... I have a feeling some people speak slower than others. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like. I have a fear. That's how some people read, apparently. <laughs> Rika, we are leaving. Yes. Yeah. One last look back. Lift off. I like these manga style cutscenes. It's better than trying to animate a pixel for it's, these. It's, yeah. They're gone. And I I read that late by the way. Ren, I Rika. The road you choose will probably be painful and... Something, something. Processing, processing, <laughs> process, difficult. Okay. <laughs> you, are our ho you are our hope. You must be strong and live with pride. G go on. 
Yes, and thank you. Okay, that time we were waiting for her to decide how to respond. Okay. <laughs> now we're coming up with excuses. <laughs> I've got to go back to Toei. Chaz, thanks for everything. To know? I don't know. I feel, I feel I've learned a lot from this trip. Thanks. Okay. I'm returning to the academy. <laughs> After all this, I've become disgusted with some of the... What? Some of, some of the what? <laughs> some of the what? What are you disgusted with? People there, oh, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll just have to transform those feelings into inner strength. I know that's what he's going to say next. Oh my gosh, Mike can see the future! <laughs> Goodbye, Chaz. I will always be proud that I fought beside you. And died repeatedly. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Actually, he has. <laughs> <laughs> Chaz, I, I guess it's goodbye. Rune? Even though the battle against the ultimate fiend is over, my... Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it! Mission as Lutz must continue. Are you going to be a Fantasy Star Online? No! <laughs> you see, I must watch over all all go. 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 <laughs> I'm still lacking in training experience. You're even, level 99! <laughs> even though I'm level 99, <laughs> I must get to level 200. I must continue to improve myself and eventually Level 200. Pass. He is in Fantasy Star Online. It went to the next Lutz. Okay. Won't we meet again? Probably not. By the way, I can teleport between planets. You silly, don't cry. You can live with, you can live now without anyone else's help. Total wimp baby the black. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> Rika! Chaz! She's looking back. Tears! Oh, they're doing that thing where the a character cries, moves their head, and the teardrops, like, Fall splash out. out. <laughs> Falling lady! So, uh, tears do not work that way, by the way! <laughs> Rika! Chaz! Let's say each other's names repeatedly. <laughs> that way you know we're a couple. So long, Chaz. Take care. I'm off to teleport between planets, because I can apparently do that. <laughs> Rune. Rune, thank you, and goodbye. I'm right here, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and away they go. Because we first found Rune on Motavia... But then we go to Desilus and we find the. Well, I'll have to explain that one. The long battle is oh, over. Oh, it's the narrator. <laughs> <clears throat> we were able to free ourselves from the terrible curse of Yor. What did I think these guys were at first? I can't remember. They're owl people, but I thought they were. You thought they rat. were rats. I thought they were rats because they look like rats in the original game. <laughs> <laughs> To the souls of those who sacrificed their lives for all you. I'm getting drunk off my <laughs> <laughs> I'm such an honorable priest. Sleep in peace. <laughs> and from person to person. That's the same person. Yeah. <laughs> from that person <laughs> to that person. It's the same person. <laughs> <laughs> from age to age. Yeah. Showing the two people that don't have age. That don't have age. <laughs> well, one's 900 and some years old, and the other one's like 300. As long as memories last. And... The guy who has some memories. <laughs> Whoa! We will not forget the sacrifices that have been made. They're just wearing regular clothes now! I have a blue tongue for some reason! What the... <laughs> <laughs> oh, zoom in on that! <laughs> what the heck was that? I'm a Newman! The eons old struggle between light and dark has ended, and now the curtain rises on a new age. 
And then we see Super Mario Brothers 3 show up. <laughs> <laughs> Curtain rising. So, what I was saying before about Rune teleporting between... I was like, we find one of Octavia just wandering around, doing stuff, and then we go to Desolus after we get a spaceship. The only spaceship in the whole game, basically, and go to the, the Esper Mansion... And they're like, oh, it's you, Rune. The fifth generation one. So it's like, he somehow went from Desolus to Motavia without a spaceship. <laughs> then again, Lutz in Fantasy Star 2, which was still the first generation Lutz in, in uh, Hibernation, he teleported us in Fantasy Star 2 to the final dungeon, which was a spaceship out who knows where in space. So... Yeah, let's can do that. It's like <laughs> just I, teleport. I don't need a spaceship. Whoop. <laughs> the can design Sugawa Nishiyama. Map design Sugawa again. <laughs> Yoshida. Design. Sugawa Yoshida Kodama and Nishiyama. And Nishiyama again. And there's lots of Nishiyama going on here. Yoshida. <laughs> I got the feeling there's maybe five people. I know, right? <laughs> oh, the days when people working on a video game could be so small in teams. Uh, D. Yamamoto. I don't think I've seen his name up there yet. She, uh, and I thought that was M. M. Night Shyamalan for a second Shyamalan. there. <laughs> what a twist. What's a twist? He was probably just a little kid when this came out. Uh, oh, music. They, they got a different person working on music. music. Uh, so, I know. take a... But then, you know, it's kind of hard to tell when they abbreviate the first name. Of yeah. Everybody. Yeah, it's like, it could be like... It could just be common last names. It could be like <laughs> someone completely different. Canari. They could have had like five families work on this. That would have been a pretty Sign good sized up. team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This game was about 200 bucks when it first came out for the Genesis. Yeah. It's it's like the only fantasy star well, like game. 200, 100 bucks. It's the only fantasy star. Oh no! K. Oh no! <laughs> um, it's like the only fantasy star game that you could maybe justify it because it's like the best one. If if you were charging that much for like fantasy star three, no. Oh no! <laughs> Created by Team PS4. Presented by Sega. Okay then. <laughs> and anything else, game? Planet. Sunrise. Ow. Finn. Finn. It's a statue of Alice and Maya. It's owl. Adventure Time. Come on, grab your friends. <laughs> With Finn the human, it was in Fantasy Star for some reason. as text. Uh. Well, guess that's about it, man. <laughs> this has been a wild ride. Sega. Uh, well, Mike, it's your game. Finish us off. Finish it off. Uh, well, it's it's going back to the beginning part now. Um, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Wait, 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 wait. If if you press, uh, what what button was it? Uh, okay. Um, there's, there's some type of ah. Okay, yeah, that would be see, that would be the B button. Uh, this the, is a sound the test. Sound test. That's a a little extra secret for the very end of the video. Winners. That's the victory music. Winners. Winning. <laughs> Epo. What? <laughs> okay, are we done? Yes. Okay. Have fun, everybody. Thanks for watching all four Fantasy Star videos. If anyone did that, <laughs> see ya. All four Fantasy Star videos.